Hello friends, it's Prajal Patek this side and you are watching my YouTube channel Pai Guru. Friends, in the last video we discussed about what is turtle, okay? And then we saw how can we create a window using turtle or you can say that a screen using turtle and we also learned how can we change the background is color of the screen and title of the screen, okay? In this video, moving further, let's talk about how can we create a turtle, okay? Uh, in the last video, we saw a glimpse of it. So, in this video, there are a few topics that I will be discussing, see here. Uh, first of all, we learn how can we create a turtle object, okay? Then we will learn how can we move the turtle and then how can we change the direction of the turtle? Finally, we will be creating a square using the turtle, okay? So, let's see for the coding this I will be using again ideally, okay? Not Sublime Text 3. Uh, Sublime Text 3 will be using for writing longer programs, okay? Uh, why ideally? Because ideally instantly runs anything, okay? Any command that you give it instantly runs it, okay? So, to uh, Use that uh, to create a turtle. First of all, we have to import the turtle module. So let's import it. Import turtle. Okay, see here. And if I press enter, uh, uh, okay, uh, here I have imported a turtle. See, uh, turtle is available by default as we discussed in the last video. So there will be no error uh, while importing it. Uh, okay, uh, to create a turtle, first of all, you have to create a turtle name. Okay, for example, I am uh, giving this name T. You can uh, give the turtle any name. Okay, I am giving just T and inside this turtle module turtle module okay we have a class called turtle class okay t u r t l e always remember this first uh, thing is the module name that is our module name uh, that is turtle and then uh, the this thing after the dot operator is actually a class okay and what we are doing here we are actually creating an object of this class okay turtle class we are creating object of this class which name is t okay when I press enter, you will see two, two things happening. First, a uh, window will open by default, okay? And there will be a, a small arrow in the center of that window. So, if I press enter, you will see a window will open. See, a window opened automatically, okay? And there is a small arrow in the center of the arrow, okay? Always remember, this screen is actually like a Cartesian plane, okay? Uh, in Cartesian plane, we know that the center is actually 0, 0. Uh, this side is positive x-axis. The above side is positive y axis, this side is negative x axis, and the downside is negative y axis. Okay, there are four coordinates one, two, three, and four. Okay, we already learn, we already have learned it in high schools. Okay, so we are going to use it. See, there is a uh, arrow in the center of this Cartesian plane. This arrow is known as turtle. Okay, and this uh, its name is T. Yes, yeah, see, we have defined its name as T. You can give this arrow any name, we have defined it by T. Okay. Always remember, in turtle we are doing one thing, we are working with vectors, okay? Vectors are uh, those uh, things which have both uh, magnitude and direction. See, here, this turtle has zero magnitude because it is as currently as at 0, 0, and it has a direction of positive x-axis, see? It, uh, where it is facing, it is facing toward the positive x-axis, so, okay? So, see, it has a direction and a zero magnitude, okay? So, it's a vector. Now we know that we can make, uh, how can we move further uh, this vector, see, I have a method called forward method, okay, for example, suppose I have to move this uh, turtle forward side, okay, uh, this side, so I, uh, th there is a function, or you can say that a method, since it's uh, attached to a class, so we will be calling it as a, a method, so there is a method called forward method, okay, uh, always remember, since it's a method, or you can say a function, it will be followed by opening and closing parentheses, okay. Inside this parenthesis, we have to tell Python how, by how many pixels we want to move the turtles, okay? For uh, suppose, if I want to move it by 50 pixels forward, so I will just type 50, and when I press enter, you will see this uh, turtle will move 50 pixels this uh, to the positive x-axis, okay? See, it moved 50 pixels on the positive x-axis, okay? You can again make it move forward. Uh, Okay, again, you if you again run this command, see it will again move 50 pixels forward from this position. Okay, see from this position it has moved 50 pixels forward. Again, you can do this by writing the same command and see it will again move 50 pixels forward. Okay, uh, if you don't want if or you want to copy the last previous command, you can press Alt P and the previous command will be copied to the this line. Okay, uh, similarly, if you want to move the turtle back side, there's a command that T dot backward. Okay. And you can again give the pixel uh, or amount of pixel by which you want to move the turtle back. Okay, for example, I want to move it by 300 pixels. Okay, uh, see, 
we have already moved the circle by 150 pixels in total see 50 plus 50 100 and then again plus 50 is 150 okay so uh, at current position it's 150 pixels away from the center our center is this and uh, at this position it is 150 pixels away from this okay so when we will be moving it backward it will first go this 150 pixels and then again go 150 pixels to the minus y direction okay if i press enter see it came from here 300 pixels backward okay and uh, around here uh, there was our center okay so you can move the turtle backward or forward using forward method or backward method inside the method you have to tell how, by what amount you want to move the turtle okay so again see t dot uh, now say forward 10 okay okay see uh, it just moved a little so you can pass any float value any integer value anything inside it okay so this is uh, this is the basic uh, movement okay that uh, see only on we have only two movements uh, either the turtle can move forward or backward okay now let's see how can we uh, change the direction of the turtle okay to change the uh, there are only two directions in turtle you can either move it right or to the left okay see when you move right the turtle will move clockwise okay and when you will move uh, to the left it will move anti clockwise it will face anti clockwise okay for example let's move toward the right by 90 degrees okay inside right method we pass degrees inside forward and backward backward method we pass pixels okay to t if i uh, run t dot right by 90 degrees it see currently it's say, seeing toward positive x axis but uh, when i will execute this command it will start seeing towards negative of y axis okay because it will turn 90 degrees to the right okay if i press enter see now it, it, it has started facing down okay it has turned 90 degrees towards the right okay again you can move it forward uh, by 50 pixels okay see it now it moves 50 pixels forward again you can move forward by 100 pixels okay see again it moved uh, see again if i turn it towards the right it will move towards this uh, uh, clockwise direction okay always remember if you are moving the turtle towards right it will always move towards the clockwise direction okay t dot right by 45 degree and if i press enter see it turned towards the right by 45 degrees so you can again move it t dot forward by 50 degrees okay see it it moved 50 degrees at the 45 degree angle from this uh, negative y axis okay again you can move it t dot now see the left one okay left method it moves the turtle toward uh, it turns the turtle toward the left direction by uh, the amount of angle you specify, you specify inside this parenthesis okay so if you want to move it by 120 degree you can simply press 120 degree okay and again t dot forward sorry and 100 pixels okay see so you can there are four methods defined for us forward backward left and right okay forward and backward are for movements and right and left are for changing directions okay now let's uh, restart this uh, cell okay i i have restarted this cell you can press ctrl f6 directly uh, again uh, import turtle import turtle okay let's create a turtle by any name for example this time i am creating by tur okay you can give any name then again uh, inside this turtle module we have a met, uh, class called turtle class okay always remember this this t is capital when i will press enter a uh, screen will open as we have previously seen see a uh, screen got opened okay uh, look if you don't want to uh, control the properties of this screen that is you don't want to change its dimensions its background color its title you don't have to create the screen that we have learned in the last video because turtle object by default creates a screen for us see this screen got created by default okay so we don't have to create it manually okay if you don't want to control the properties of this screen okay then only now let's try to create a square okay so what can you do uh, tur dot forward okay let's suppose by 100 pixels okay and if i press enter see it moved 100 pixels uh, to the positive x-axis then I'm going to move it towards right uh, turn it towards right so how can we move tur dot right to by 90 degrees okay so if I press enter see it turned 90 degrees to the right then again tur dot forward 
let's move it by 100 pixels toward the positive uh, negative y axis okay then again we have to move it towards right then move uh, forward uh, okay so we have to keep doing this until we end up with a square okay uh, right by 90 degrees okay tur dot forward by 100 pixels okay tur dot right by 90 degrees okay tur dot forward by 100 pixels and finally we'll end up with a square okay and if i press enter finally uh, a square got created here okay uh, actually this you can see it's a very long uh, tedious process to create a simple square we can do this in minimum uh, only few lines of codes uh, using the for loops okay let's again restart this uh, cell by pressing ctrl f6 uh, sorry ctrl f6 okay it's not working okay so i have created a, here a new cell okay see at the bottom let's for, again import the turtle okay this time uh, give let's again give the turtle a name by t and inside this turtle module we have a turtle class okay and see again we have got a screen by default okay and now using the for loop we are going to create this in a minimum line of code okay so what we will do simply for i in range uh, 4 see there are 4 sides inside the square so we are running it 4 times okay we will run, uh, run the uh, for loop 4 sides okay uh, what we will first do t dot forward uh, 100 pixels and then finally uh, we'll also move it by t dot right by 90 degrees okay this is the uh, entire code by which we can create a, a square if i press enter see a square got created okay so you can do this with a simple for loop actually we'll be learning it in detail in the next video where we, where we will be learning how can we create basic shapes using python okay using turtle so this was just for an example okay so hope you learned how can you move the turtle uh, forward backward right or left if you didn't understood this just leave it uh, for now okay we'll learn it in detail in the next video okay so uh, this was it uh, in this guy videos uh, hope you learned uh, how can you change the uh, magnitude and direction of our turtle okay so yep this is it uh, if you are new to my channel subscribe it thank you see you in the next video